please. Oh. <laughs> What's up, everybody? I'm Jerry Game, and welcome back to the channel today. Today, we're back. Some monster on the right, some break, and I am giving you my title update 5 poison raw build and this thing is absolutely juicy you saw in the opening of the video we can get at least up to 396 damage which is just absolutely disgusting the thing about this build though the skill investment is a lot higher than your standard raw build but it's worth it because you do amazing damage and also too not only are you doing this amazing damage in your regular strikes but when you activate poison on the monster, the monster's also taking big damage as well, very, very frequently. This one has a resistance to poison, so it does 10 damage, but typically on most monsters, every single tick is for 30 damage on top of the standard damage you're doing as well, which makes the poison build almost, I would say, I have one more weapon to test before we can identify which is the strongest, but this is a high contender for the strongest weapon compared to the last build I had about a couple, uh, about a week ago. But before we get any further, make sure you guys give the video a thumbs up and subscribe if you're new. I'm gonna break down the skills and all the things you need to make this build happen. I found without further ado, let's dive in. So to make this build possible, I'm gonna be using the Luna Longsword because it's absolutely amazing. We're gonna be using the, the Teostra headpiece, the Risen Camellios chest and arm piece. And I like this one from the Sugar, Risen Sugar Magala because of the Frenzy Berserk, uh, Frenzy skill you got on it. But also too, I'm using the lovely, lovely new monster because it gives me heaven sent, which is absolutely amazing. So looking at the skills that you need, if you look, I have attack maxed out. I got crit I4, I got crit boost maxed out, weakness exploit, handicraft. I need at least three levels of it for it to be comfortable because you do get purple sharpness when you maximize this weapon all the way out. Quick sheet three, Camellia's blessing, because it, when you, what this does is it allows you to have, when you, when you, put poison on a monster it makes it last longer mellow hellfire three that's like my go-to raw damage buff Ore three build up boost three bloodlust two i love this imperturbed heart level two because it one it protects you from getting knocked back works really good with heaven strike heaven send and also i got burst on here as well parimental heaven send and frenzy bloodlust so these is my current set i'm running because it just works all so well for people that are, are not familiar, Camille's Blessing, when you get level 3, extends duration of poison effect on monsters. What I told you earlier, for Ray, what this does is increase attack power and affinity when attacking a large monster affected by poison and paralysis or elemental blight. So essentially, you get 20 affinity with this and you get 15 of just raw attack. And to the point where sometimes we might be over on our, um, on our affinity. Build up boost is amazing because what it does increase attack power when you land attacks that build poison, sleep, blast, or exhaust, and it gives me a max a maximum of additional 20% more damage. Bloodlust is on there because that's amazing. It just does more damage. I'm trying to see if I can squeeze in one more of these because they're so good. Hmm. Talked about that one. Maximum mine I might switch out because I think I'm I to be honest as I'm recording it I might be over affinity. Let me just check it really quick. Then got burst on there. Power Man took this explosion damage sporadically, sporadically to the match. Then you got Heaven Sand and Frenzy Bloodlust. So starting from the top, we have the Luna Longsword. And this one, I augmented it all the way with attack maximum. And you have two slots over which you can't do anything with. So I just put Poison on there. When you get to level slot level 9, you get additional 20 sharpness, which puts you all the way into the purple. I wish they would have made it just a little bit more purple, but you know, it is what it is. Moving across, my augmentation I have on this one is I have just a standard, the first level augmentation because I wanted to turn the level, the level three into a level four and add a one slot jewel on there. Next one, I got lucky. I didn't need Wire Buzz Whisper. I wasn't going to go level three. So I swapped that out for a build up boost on this one. Next one across, what I got here was I have Mail of Hellfire. This is where I got my three levels. Mail of Hellfire again. No slots added on this one. And last but not least, Mel Hellfire, I believe, on this one as well. Yes. Mel Hellfire added to this one. I was hoping to get an additional slot, but sometimes getting what you want and getting rid of a skill you don't want is kind of challenging. So this is the kind of the route we went. With a talisman, the one I'm rocking right now is my OG. It has two attack, two crit eye, and two level threes on it. Allow me to use handicraft from whatever other skill I want to use as well. And the decoration needed to make this not possible is the following. I got chain on there. I have anti-wavarian jewel because this is probably the best jewel you can use. 
attack four, a two slot attack, haze jewel for my Camellio's blessing, for Ray level four, attack four, quick sheet, quick sheet for critical boost, bloodlust, handicraft, handicraft, and uh, blood and jewel. I would love to get one more level of bloodlust, but I just can't. If I can get it on my headpiece, in addition to getting these skills, it'd be useful. Maybe if I just get like Bloodlust and one level four, that might work, but it's kind of challenging to get exactly what you want. I, I kind of essentially blew through all of my my melding material because I couldn't get exactly what I wanted, but I felt pretty good with how this set um, landed. We're doing some pretty juicy damage, so let's go ahead and show some monsters and see what it looks like in a real battle. Oh, yes. I love that damage. Okay. Let's go, baby. Let's see what we can do. I'm out. Ooh. I'm mad the other ones didn't crit, but it's okay. Oh my goodness. Oh. I love when that happens. This is just so satisfying to get those. Okay. Okay. Oh. Please. Please. Oh, that's the one. That's the one. Okay, let's get that back. Oh, just like that, sharpness is back as well. Oh, oh, I, I love that skill so much. Hmm. Oh, come on. Doesn't want anything from me. Okay. Whew. Don't come in here. Oh. <laughs> so good. So I came here only looking for some action. Ooh. I got some smoke too, baby. Ooh, that one is dangerous, but. Mm. Oh. <laughs> Beautiful. Okay, let's finish what we started here. Baby, <laughs> stop it. Okay, <laughs> I love that move so much. He was like, well, he doesn't even know what happened to him. For a second, I lost him as well. Mm -hmm. Okay, get my sharpness back. Please. 
so beautiful. Okay. Just, just keep it coming. Oh, how was I not in this hit zone right there? No time to sleep around here. Oh, that sequence. That sequence is just so beautiful. I didn't get a tail right there. Oh, I guess I, it's okay. I get my sharpness back. Oh, it wasn't time, but we did it <laughs> just because. like that <laughs> you can't even see what's going on in here Is this whole this whole fight about to be the highlight? My goodness. Ladies and gentlemen, thanks for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. This is our poison build. It's absolutely lethal. So all the ingredients you need to make it happen are in the video. I hope you guys are enjoying your time with the game. My family stays smooth till next time. Dear gamer signing out.